Opposition parties in Ogun State were divided over the outcome of the last Saturday's governorship election won by Governor Dakbo Abiodu. The chairman of the Inter-Party Advisory Council, IPAC, Samson Okusonya, at a press conference commended the Independent National Electoral Commission for the success of the election, describing it as free, fair and credible. Meanwhile, the coalition of registered political parties led by the state chairman of the new Nigeria People's Party, NNPP, Ogini Olaposi, rejected Abiodun's declaration by INEC in its entirety, saying it cannot stand, insisting that the body lacks powers to endorse any governorship candidate or validate the outcome of the polls in the matter which Okusonya led IPAC did. We, may, we commend INEC for early commencement of the voting a majority of the polling units in Ogun State. We also commend INEC for early transmission of the result, of which have helped to validate the integrity of the electoral exercise. We commend INEC for early mobilization of human and material resources to the various polling units in the state and also for their brilliant performance. The high pack we shall of us belong as no locus of constitutional power to endorse or comment or support any candidate as far as the constitution of high park is concerned all of us here that are registered with the party we are legal members of high park and we are telling you that whatever high park has done without our knowledge is an exercise in futility and it cannot stand the test of time is a criminal act against the constitution of IPAC, and any governor that is heading and abetting criminal act in our polity must be warned. Ogini therefore called for the suspension of the resident electoral commissioner Ni Ijalaye and the arrest of the state returning officer Professor Kayode Adebowale, who is the vice chancellor of the University of Ibadan, for committing what they described as heinous crime against democracy. The Auguste Coalition of Registered Political Parties hereby call for immediate suspension of Auguste Resident Electoral Commissioner and immediate arrest and prosecution of Professor Kayo Diadebowale, the Vice Chancellor of the University of Ibadan, for this heinous crime against democracy. But it's unfortunate that Professor Adebowale made himself an instrument of destruction to our democracy by making an announcement that is contrary to the rule and regulation. And whatever he has done, we know that he cannot stand the test of time. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.